So now back my snowberry. Here it is last November, slowly losing its leaves for the winter. In February it was time for a hard prune. It does have lots of fine twigging, which is excellent. The only problem is it all kind of happens at the same place. So it just needs a good trim to try and thin it out a bit. Otherwise it's going to start to form little knuckles and weird taper. So I just trimmed everything back and made sure there was only two branches from one position. As you can see it's pretty fiddly as they're really small. This tree has some great ramification already. It's not really been in development that long but it's a fast grower. Here it is after, all ready for the season. They'll be covered in buds in no time. In March the buds are starting to swell. Let me show you a better angle, it's hard to see the buds against the wall. In April it's time for a repot. Well, it was actually probably ready in March. The leaves are a little too open here, but what are you going to do about it? If you look at the soil line here, it's really high. So it's clearly full of roots and start to push itself out of the pot. So let's get it out and see how crazy the roots are. And as you can see, they're jam packed in there. This tree is an extremely aggressive grower, both on top and below. So we need to get this all untangled and then I'll see what's going on. You can see near the base, it has actually got quite a good root spread. It's just crazy long. I just trimmed everything back. And this is what I was left with. It looks kind of drastic, but it's not really. There is still a lot of roots left on here. They're just a lot shorter now. I'm going to put it back in the same pot. I think it looks quite good in there. So I just placed it on some soil and backfilled it up. In May it's looking healthy, it's really started to grow, so that slightly late repot did no harm whatsoever. In June it's looking a little leggy, so time for its first prune. 
and just took everything back to two or three leaves. I also had to remove a lot of shoots as they were all grown from the same spot. It's a constant battle with this tree. So now it looks a little bare, but don't worry, it's just a two step back, one step forward kind of tree. In July it's filled back in again. I told you this was a, a fast grower. So of course, time for another trim. I just did the same again, taking everything back, but this time there was no extra shoots growing in bad spots. So nothing really needed to be removed, it was just a trim back. So now it looks much better. In August it's looking pretty good, I'm really happy with it. It's still very healthy in September but it will have stopped growing for now. And here we are now, it's definitely had a good year. Thanks for watching, see you next time.